How you doing guys? Um, yesterday I picked up this flatback canoe for free. Uh, it's definitely been sitting for a couple of years and there is some damage here and there. So last night I picked it up and I decided to go to Home Depot and buy some Flex Seal. And Flex Seal the entire inside of it. It's got a rubbery finish. I mean, it came out pretty good. So I filled it up with water, and there was one tiny leak right here, which we're going to take care of today. We're going to sand it down today, hopefully patch up the damaged areas, and then from there paint it. Well, I'm thinking about a hunter green color. Now, I'm not a professional in fixing these. This is going to be my first one, and I'm not trying to make this show quality. I'm basically just trying to get from point A to point B. And uh, it's going to still look a little rough, but it's going to be fully functional. Alright, stay tuned. I'm going to go out, pick up some supplies, and then start this uh, project. Okay, so I did some sanding. Here's what this side looks like. I'll show you what the other side looks like. Still covered in mold and just junk from years of sitting under a tree. definitely a long process. I still have no idea what I'm gonna do with these screw holes. I mean, they did fix the transom, they doubled it with two pieces of wood, but I'm thinking about maybe fiberglassing or something. Or, Like I said, I've never done this before, so I'm gonna kinda just go winging it really, and uh, like I said, it's not gonna be a show quality kind of would be a little battle cruiser so learning experience I guess alright guys so I went to West Marine and we're gonna go with a sea green top coat for the paint and after talking to those guys I didn't want to go do fiberglass work so we're gonna do this stuff here and uh... Here's where we stand right now. Uh, we have this here to fix, which didn't go through all the way, but we're going to try with the putty. And we got to just, you know, putty up holes like that and all these little holes here. So we will see how this turns out soon. I'm still kind of worried about this here. I mean, it is sealed. It does hold water because I did fill this up with water. But uh, I don't know. I haven't decided what I'm going to do with it yet. But we'll see. Stay tuned. Okay, so instead of doing the fiberglass, I decided to go with the surfacing putty. And it's pretty much all done now, just waiting for it to dry. That was the big crack I was talking about earlier. I'll sand that down. And then uh, she'll be ready for paint. Alright guys, here's the first coat. A 
We did a really light coat, so most of those little hairline cracks will be filled in with the second coat. But uh, overall progress so far. Now keep in mind, it's not perfect, and it was never supposed to be perfect. It was a free canoe that I got, and just trying to make it worthy again to go on a little couple of trips.